Welcome boys and girls, welcome to Mr. Luke's YouTube channel. Today we'll be reacting to major health scares after flooding in New South Wales. One week ago today, the deluge started. Now in a sign Ooh, the flood emergency has sign. finally eased. Bridges are reopening after being That's submerged, Richmond, cutting the communities off for days. But there's a new health scare tonight with floodwaters contaminated by leaking septic tanks. Septic tanks. Receding floodwaters oh. are revealing more graphic devastation every day. A caravan park, park decimated, buildings smashed together. In some places, only foundation foundations. Foundations. Oh, washing. But there's some relief oh, after Richmond being cut Ridge. off for days at North Richmond. Residents are finally able to get North through Ridge, with floodwaters subsiding enough to allow cars to use the bridge. North Fantastic Ridge. news. It means that all of the families up here that haven't had any food for quite some time will have access to food again. So it's really exciting. The Windsor Bridge Windsor opened Ridge. only late today after it was found to be structurally sound. <laughs> That meant the only way home for young William last night was by SES rescue boat. Hello! His first trip home was just as dramatic as his mum's dash to hospital going into labour. Mid-disaster meant a chopper ride out of the flood devastation for a safe delivery in hospital. <sighs> On the mid-north coast last night, 45 That's homes were evacuated here. at Stewart's Point after several septic tanks burst. Yeah, we don't know what sort of diseases that may come with that sort of stuff. This emergency only adding to the disaster, another blow for flood-ravaged locals. Very scary. It feels very scary. There is financial relief for flood-affected oh, businesses. Big go now. Oops, sorry. <laughs> the PM announcing the banks will extend a lifeline, interest-free loans, during a visit at an SES base in Western Sydney. Five million dollar loans for businesses up to 250 million dollars in turnover. While well, this bridge reopening is a massive step forward for life as a real game mate. changer. The effects of the flood continue to spread far and wide now with health warnings being issued for beaches and waterways all along the coast. That advice didn't stop surfers from riding the brown swell and not far off Baron Joey oh, where the beach. Hawkesbury meets the ocean what looks like part of someone's home someone's is all at sea. Evan Batten. Thanks for watching, boys and girls. See you later. Goodbye.